our problem is our problem is we all talk about diseases somebody has told us we talk about it you are even telling hepatitis b vaccine do you know the real science behind hepatitis b it is not required in india at all our risk of hepatitis b is 0.16% and that to what risk for people like us it is higher risk because i am a doctor you are a nurse or whatever and you are a healthcare worker you have to but go to the school and vaccinate children my god there are so many contraindications for and i am frightened that homo altruisticus rotarians get into this homo economics business of selling vaccines please think about it please think about it i don't want you to do anything except think read go deep into it and find out now reason why smallpox is eradicated is that's the natural vaccination what does a student read in the book edward jenner did vaccination if edward jenner did vaccination all would have all of us would have died of smallpox because what he used was cowpox which today we know by genetic engineering is totally different from smallpox virus but there was a doctor sent by the east india company to india to study indian vaccination system in the 18th century the year was 1767 and the man's name was t z hallwell h o l w e l l he was an frs a scientist and an frcp london he came to india and went to bengal and saw the beautiful ayurvedic system of vaccination prevalent in the 17th century 18th century and he waited there for 20 years to prospectively study the vaccinated people with savi the non vaccinated people and found out vaccinated 90% this is gone and he went back and submitted this report in 16 1747 to the royal college president to be handed over to the king and from then on the indian vaccination system prevails where attenuated smallpox virus is used not cowpox virus of edward jenner and if you want to know what edward jenner did you will now hang him he had a boy called phips james phips as his errand boy very poor boy in his clinic and there is a cow maid who came and told him i am not worried about smallpox doctor uh, uh, jenner i have had cowpox he said cowpox gives you protection again yes yes so he asked her next time your cow gets cowpox get me some lymph so she got him the next cow lymph and he injected this to the boy and tell, told him i'll give you some injection for strength this boy almost died of severe cowpox he survived with the skin of his teeth the minute he survived this fellow injects him smallpox pus can you believe that and he was lucky he survived and that's vaccination no that's not vaccination no the truth you go to the internet and say indian vaccination system and you will get all the details of what see this is what's happening what you know what the television tells you what the paper writes may not be the truth may not be the truth it's not the truth the whole truth nothing but the truth